Hi there, this is Paul Clues for Ilfracoom TV. We have glorious sunshine and today we are expecting the Olympic flame. So you're looking forward to seeing the torch? I really am, yes, it's quite, a, quite a, a, a good experience. It'll be a unique experience for everybody. So have you travelled very far to get here? Well actually we live in London so we have in fact have travelled quite a long way. Have you but come special? Not special, well actually we stayed on There. What's your name? Bob. Bob Corwin. Yeah, and you're from the uh, Gig uh, boat, by the look Pilot at. Gig Club. Absolutely. Great. Tell us a little bit about the uh, Gig Club. Oh, goodness me. We've been around for nearly four years now. And we are now, from having started from scratch, we are now recognised as the club to beat in Devon. And in the World Championships, our ladies, vets, achieved fourth place out of well over 60 clubs. That's and very we're good. We're going some. That's really good. Are you looking forward to the torch coming by? Absolutely. Are you going to be giving a big cheer? Oh, I think so. <laughs> Thanks for the interview. No problem. Cheers. So, what's your name? Sarah Jury. And where have you come from? Uh, come from Timkin. Tim Not Kim too Ray. far then. Not too far, Just no. walk down the road. Yes. Are you definitely. looking forward to seeing it? Yes, definitely. Are you going to be going to see the games themselves? Uh, probably watch it on the telly, to watch be honest. Yeah. What are you looking forward to most? Uh, I jump. The eye jump. Yeah. It's probably more my thing, really, but that's it. So then, Jonathan, how did it feel to come home with the torch? I mean, it's just lovely to come home. To come home with the torch was almost too much. Very, very emotional, very proud. When I lived here, I never imagined that I would be an Olympian, um, that I'd be part of the organising committee that would bring the Games to London, and, and then end up running with the torch in Ilfracoom. Just stunning. I believe you played on these fields as a youngster. I played a couple of rugby games here. I don't think I exactly said it a lot, but yeah, I certainly did. And I spent countless hours climbing the rocks on Hillsborough down at Rappery Beach and all the way around. Um, yeah, this is, this is my home and it is still incredibly important to me. And what will the, what will the, the Olympics bring to Ilfracoon? Well, I think you see here a whole bunch of kids doing sport and hopefully the inspiration and excitement today will be something which will stay with them, not just for today.